Hello everybody, welcome to Candidates Cards on the Table. In this final episode we're going to be discussing proposals related to security. First up is Pablo. Hi everyone, the first candidate proposes the following. First, promoting spaces for civic pedagogy and participation that promote peaceful coexistence and resolution of conflict, with a special emphasis on prevention against violence against women. The second, enacting intelligence operation and international cooperation to help with illegal trafficking weapons and dismantle the, these networks. The third, carrying out a huge campaign of civic disarmament of coordination with these populations. The fourth, destroying all the illegal crops that belong to drug traffickers and criminal structures and continuing the strategy of voluntary substitution in accordance with this peace process. And the final, last, designing a program of recompensation for those who report illegal mining. Well, a good thing about it is the emphasis on reducing violence against women and the plan seeks to international cooperation, which is novel. And a bad thing is that expecting witness recompensation to stop illegal mining is wishful thinking. We need legal and institutional structures. The second candidate proposes lowering the homicide rate from 24 to 19 per 100,000 people, increasing the police presence based on the need for patrols in strategic places in both urban and rural zones, leading weekly security councils to monitor security policies with a demand for clear results, increasing the technical capacity of the state at a national, departmental and municipal level for the collection and analysis of data for a more improved national security and coexistence. A good thing about these proposals is that the collecting information to help establish the needs of each region is needed. A bad thing is that it is not specified how the candidate intends to lower the homicide rate also, the solutions are thought too much in terms of force and not in terms of civil culture. Hi everyone, the three candidates proposed are the following. In first place, the implementation of an effective judicial processes and a reduction of impunity, and how increasing, uh, increasing and resizing the prosecutors to have an effective 24 hours judicial processes, and how lowering the age of a legal responsibility from 12, 14 to 12 and restructuring of impact. The second place is a strengthening of the national police by developing strategies to deal with the most persisting crimes, increasing the numbers of police on patrol. The third one is new strategies to support citizen security, having voluntary communities watch groups to watch over their own neighborhood. And finally, special attention for the neighborhood with the highest rates of crime on the principal cities. Well, in first place, the good point of this is because increase and, you know, shows a real improvement in the citizen security because in the last year have been decreased, uh, increasing a lot of crimes. The negative way of this proposal is that the children's rights organization will oppose to the lowering of the age for the legal responsibility because it's not focusing the real problem. It's just focused in putting jail on these kids. Hello everyone. Our fourth candidate proposes strengthening and modernizing the military forces in order to have a more effective border control and fight against drug trafficking and organized crime making the eradication and substitution of illegal crops obligatory and do a constitutional prohibition of narco-trafficking and related crimes. Also, focusing on cooperation and action against the laundering of illicit funds, including all that the FARC are trying to hide. And lastly, the support and finance for citizen security to help reduce crime in their neighborhoods. A positive thing about these proposals are that they're focused on money laundering, which is a very contentious topic for our country. And one negative aspect is that it's only focused on the force, and also it can modify the peace agreement, which will have very serious consequences. Hi everyone, our final candidate proposes. Firstly, making a distinction between occasional drug users and narco-traffickers 
focusing on health programs uh, rather than criminalizing users. Sí. Making the judicial system independent of politics to tackle corruption. The lack of justice perpetuates the violence in the country. Thirdly, guaranteeing the implementation of the peace agreement and seeking tr truth and reparation for victims of the conflict. Guaranteeing the implementation of the peace agreement and seeking truth and reparation for the victims of the conflict. And finally, modifying the drafting of the security forces so that they are appropriate for times of peace. A good thing is that the reform of justice is needed, but a bad thing is that it is not clear, clear how exactly these proposals, proposals would help combat crime, organized crime. It is a big break. The first candidate is Humberto de la Calle. This candidate was Sergio Fajardo. The third candidate is Germán Vargas Lleras. The fourth candidate was Ivan Duque. And this candidate is Gustavo Petro. Okay, well that's been the last episode of Candidates Cards on the Table. Uh, I want to say thank you to all of the students who've taken part today and in all of the previous episodes. It wouldn't have been possible without all of your brilliant help, so thank you. Um, also, I want to say thank you to anybody who's watching out there or in class. Uh, the idea of this show was to, was to put forth the proposals of the candidates and so everyone could, could concentrate on what the candidates are proposing rather than who they are or where they come from or what they represent. Um, hopefully it's been informative, hopefully you've enjoyed them and hopefully everyone is going to vote uh, this May 27th or May 26th, 27th? 27th. 27th in the first round of the election. Uh, it's very important that everyone does so and best of luck to everyone. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Oh, 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 oh,